Eight years ago, I was so inspired to know that my nephew, a young black child, could grow up knowing his dreams could be realized by witnessing a black president in office. And now, we have the opportunity to create more change. I want my daughter to grow up seeing a woman lead our country. And know that her possibilities are limitless. We have to think about the future of our daughters, our sons, and vote for someone who cares for them as much as we do. And that is why I'm with her. And this other guy, I don't, I don't have any ill will towards him, but his conversation is divisive, and that's not an evolved soul to me. So he cannot be my president. He cannot be our president. Once you divide us, you weaken us. We're stronger together. Once you divide us, you weaken us. We are stronger together. And without further ado, I would like to introduce to you the next president of the United States, Ms. Hillary Clinton. Jay memorably said something we should all recall. Rosa Parks sat so Martin Luther could walk, and Martin Luther walked so Barack Obama could run, and Barack Obama ran so all the children could fly. Well, we have unfinished business to do, more barriers to break, and with your help, a glass ceiling to crack once and for all.